I'll just break its legs. Oh, I see. Strange General McGinnis. What's up, Zerp? How you doing? Is that a flying ship? Yo! So, I, I did some research on the Hyo thing. Apparently that's a Kabuki theater thing. And the reason being why they have that is so that the audience knows what's gonna happen is important or that character is important. Sometimes you gotta throw out the dad joke or it'll just eat you up. That's true. Player selection. You know, I never got... The, he's new. I never get to play as him. This is the outskirts. Hey, does anyone know if there's a Samurai Pizza Cats Super Nintendo game? Or if it's in English? Get a load of this! My dancing's positively gorgeous. Cut it out, Ibisumaru. You're giving me the creeps. And a boner. Oh, come on, dance with me! Like hell I will! Whoa. You. You're... Sasuke, the mechanical ninja. So he is a wind-up ninja. Goemon, I dare say, the situation is grave. Without any warning, Oyedo Castle floated into the air and flew out of sight. Was this guy introduced in this game or was he in the NES games? Yao has told me that it involves a man who goes by the name McGinnis. He makes a beer. McGinnis was that weird foreigner running the lottery. Oh, that guy that looks like Hulk Hogan? Okay. Sure. Oh crap, so this vacation was a setup! Like all vacations. Hey, it's not often anyone fools me. The ninja of righteousness. This McGinnis fellow must be quite a fearsome foe. I dare say we must hurry. Going on. Let's go, Ibisumaru. Going on, Sasuke. Wait for me. Gonna be an Irish stereotype? No, this game does not do stereotypes, Bardzerk. I don't know what you're talking about. The tale of giant Mecha's arrival. That's the last thing this game does is stereotypes. Come on. Alright, so these are my buttons. Kunai. Okay. Oh, Alright. That does that. That does that. What was this weapon? I can charge it. What does charging it do? Oh, it just explodes longer. All right, what do we got? Can I switch characters? No. Can I press select? No, okay, so that's all the buttons. What do you want, dog? You want something? Hmm? Cutting bunnies in half. What do you think of that, dog? No? Okay. My dog's not impressed by the game, though. That's fine, she's not impressed by a lot of games, to be honest. Does this... Okay, so this doesn't cost any money for me to, like, do these projectiles. That's not bad. Do I use a console device? I'm on, um, a legit Super Nintendo, and I use a power pack. So I, I am playing off of real hardware. This vehicle is terrible. What? Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Oh, now it's nice. Now it's not bad. Big difference. What is that? Okay, I have it now. Can I get off the thing? Oh, I can. Oh, look at the balls on it. It's dead! Ha <laughs> ha! 
and its balls remain. What's the map? Yeah, Japan's exactly like this. It hasn't, it hasn't changed over 400 years. Actually, there's something that I'd like to give you. Here it is. It'll help you out if you're ever in a real pinch. Just blow into this shell. You'll be able to summon my latest invention, a super ultra gorgeous and very rugged mecha. I call it Goimon Impact. Okay, so that's a new thing. It does, it does burn through fuel quickly though. Don't overuse it, you've been warned. You still have some tough companions anyways. Go and save all of the girls in Ito. Uh, I mean, go and save Oito Castle, of course. Yeah, but we know why we're doing this. What's up, guys? Ah, oh, violence! Violence! <laughs> oh. Okay, all right, all right, I get it. Are there? Yeah, that's that too. There are a lot of anime cat girls. Welcome. This is Oedo Tourism. We're currently offering teleportation services. You can warp anywhere you've already visited. You're here in the ocean. Oh, it's 500 for you. I don't need that. Look how happy people are until violence happens. Get out of here. This sounds like... This sounds like the Batman theme. Welcome, eat up and get strong. Sponge cake, diced pork, noodle cup. Noodle cup's more expensive than diced pork, huh? No, we'll go with the diced pork. Right, I'm out of here. I said, this is more what I'm talking about. I, like, Goemon 3 is a little too open-ended. This one's... This one's kind of like, it's straightforward enough. It's like the first one. Or Mystical Ninja, right? Don't mess with anybody in this town. Our officers won't let you go around hitting people. Well, they don't have much of a choice, do they? Did I rob the old lady? What? Okay, so if I hold the Y button down, I get to... And thank you for the fall there, Wiggy. Whee! All right! There it is. Why, why, why did that get the thing, but the sub did? I don't know. Was that a grass skirt? Welcome to the old man's general store. We got the best selection in the village. All right, we, a hat and a coat. Well, let's go with the coat. The coat has to be better than the hat, right? I don't, I don't get that. You touch the old lady and then she's okay. I don't need to go to the inn. Wait, is there, is there are there saves? It's the Hilton. Yeah. Uh huh. this thing you can steal enemy vehicles and ride them if you want to get off just hold up and jump well I figured that out already so oh there's another old lady I could have made 50 crossroad oh, that was nice Cat. Gonna shoot the thing? Alright. Getting off instructions. I like the layers of scrolling going on here. This so is the level getting darker? Like, is the sun actually setting? Because something's changing. guys bucket ninjas is that what's going on oh no he's got a all right now I got it what does it do it shoots like cheese
You know, I, I, I still think they could have figured out a way to localize this for the U.S. market. I, I know they said it was too Japanese to be in the U.S., but it's like they would have, you know, I, I think there'd be a market for this, especially now. Oh, there we go. There's Tanuki. Sumo Castle. I wonder what I fight there. I like the, uh, the paintings. There was two other Goemon games released in the States. One was Mystical Ninja, the first game on the Super Nintendo. And then the other one was on the N64. And that was the first game on the N64. But there's like... And that's it. Those are the only ones released in the States. But I think the NES has like four or five Goemon games. The Super Nintendo has like four. The N64 has two. It's an abacus. But it does, I, I mean, like, I can understand the third game not getting localized, because that one had a lot of dialogue, right? But it's like, really? They couldn't localize the second game? Or maybe Mystical Ninja just didn't do that well. But I would also blame the fact that, I think by the time Mystical Ninja came out in the States, it was like two years old anyways. So it wasn't that, like, you know, impressive in terms of, like, pushing the Super Nintendo. Like, it was kind of basic. Whereas these are definitely like much more like um, like mid mid to late era Super Nintendo style games. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. oh thank God! With hamburgers or donuts, like in Pokemon. Remember all the rice balls in Pokemon were donuts. Even though they didn't change the look of them, they just called them donuts, which I I feel is more confusing. Oh, you're right, there's time. I forgot. I do have to hurry. I don't know what these do. Oh, they give me coins. What's that? Oh, it's a... Little sumo guys. I cut off their heads. I'm a sumo robot man. Now what? Oh, now it's mine! Okay, now I have the sumo robot. Yeah, I can't jump. And I can't run. This is pretty much it. I, I guess I need it. Uh huh. I, Marble Red, will take you down unassisted! Bring it on, okay. Aren't you supposed to knock me out of the ring? Oh no! There, I have beaten you! Bunny man suit. Oh, I never saw this coming. I must bid you farewell for now. I'm glad that the kid from A Christmas Story got to, like, make a cameo in this. I dare say this is bad. He is going to escape. And that being the case, I will have to use this. Goemon Impact! Okay, I have no idea how to do the Goemon Impact stuff, so this should be interesting. Eats him? Don't don't. All right, it's it's just like Power Rangers slash Super Sentai. Yo. Yo. 
Uh, no, I don't think so. Not with channel points. I, I think it might help with the algorithm. You know, because, like, um, when people chat in a stream, it helps the stream out. Like, um, in other words, it, it makes the stream recommended to more people. So it might help with that, but it doesn't help, like, financially with anything. It'll buy me time to pull out my ace in the hole. The heck? Oh my god, my energy. Oh no, not the, not the people. What the? Where'd he get this army? What channel points? What's up, dude? Yeah, those channel points. So I think, like, if those channel points are spent more, and, like, there's more chat, then Twitch thinks there's more viewer engagement going on, you know? So then Twitch will recommend the channel more. It also helps when you're a partner Twitch streamer, then Twitch recommends your channel even more. That's why people, like, even now people still want to get partnered, even though with the, um, now affiliates finally make ad money and get subs and stuff. Destroy worlds. You know, if you keep spending those channel points, they're gonna go up. There's an auto economy. Booyah, you beat me once. It won't happen again, though. Let me introduce the sumo mecha. Oh, that thing that's over there with the wheels? Channel points are different from the stream, ele uh, stream element points, though. Channel points are legitimate uh, by Twitch. But they're not as like... Oh, God! Alright, okay, so I, I punch that way. Is this block? Oh. Oh, my God. Okay, so you can block... Oh, I got projectiles! Deal oh, they take energy, though. Trying to figure out the buttons here, Robot Man! What is this crap? I am not winning this fight. Ah, oh, that was the wrong button. Try eating like what? Ah, oh, I didn't read it. I was too busy trying to figure out the buttons! Can I just start at the mech fight, please? Good. Yes. Punch him hard, it'll smack it down. Okay. Punched. Yeah, those ones. You can also, like, edit uh, emotes with them. Like, give me a hat or something, I don't know. I know that happens. So, am I supposed to shoot those things? Or? Oh my god! I've established that button does nothing. Okay, it's three buttons. Plus the blocking. Oh, I can multiple? Okay. Kinda like a, it's kind of like a weird version of Punch-Out. He, he didn't even touch me! I guess he sumo bopped me or something. I don't know. Fighting like a sumo wrestler. Okay. That'll really help in a mech fight. You know, I wonder how this is controlled when it's two players. Like, does, does one player only control the left side and the second player controls the right? <coughs> oh my god! I don't know why. Oh, my nose is giving me trouble now. Taking fire? Can't dodge? How do you dodge it? Put your guard up. Yeah, I know that, but like, how do you dodge? You can dodge? There's no way to move! Oh, 
Oh yeah, you can reverse it. That's weird. Oh, maybe the right hand? Right, yeah, you can do that with the hand touching it. <laughs> I have no clue, like, it, it, am I supposed to level up the mech more or something? I don't have enough coins to keep using that. Giving up? Nah, nah, I guess I'll keep fighting. Yo! Hey, stop that. Alright, got 100 coins. Every time I use the projectile attack, it takes coins, sadly, so... Oh, wait, I can... I can't put up both both hands to block at once, sadly. Only one side. So if I screw up the side. I have the health advantage. Well, I had the health advantage. Now I don't. I don't know. Once he lost his head, I couldn't punch him anymore. Guess I had to aim for the body or something. Here we go. All right. I think I've. I think I've figured this crap out. And. Put your guard- yeah, I know about the guard thing. I, w I wouldn't have gotten this far without it. Though I still take damage when I guard, it seems. And my, my health ticks down little by little every time. I'm supposed to punch those things that he shoots at me. Oh man. Up the gun. Not good. Oh my god, why is this so hard? 
I had him too, he was down to like nothing. And then that other person's gonna come in and tell me the advice is like, try blocking! Oh wait. Having trouble with headbutts? Punch him hard to smack it down. Oh, well, okay. I forgot the buttons. See, you would think the- okay, I'm gonna explain the buttons. You would think A would be right punch, and then B would be left punch. But no, it's B and Y, and then A is the projectiles. Oh, look at that! It's close. Oh, come on! Oh my god. Wait, I have bombs? No, I have no bombs. There is a thing for bombs, but I don't know how to get bombs. Projectiles. Oh, now I'm not. Like, I mean, I try to go for the body, but there's, like, no way. If it was me, I'd randomly cough near people. Fair enough. Well, the zombie epidemic's finally happened. <laughs> Gotta figure this guy out, man. I, I have him figured out, I just... Maybe I should save my projectiles for the end? Virus. There we go. Oh, 
Th this kind of works. This one it becomes confusing because he has like no health. Oh my god, really? And then I can't hit him. I'm about to rage quit this game. Uh, guess I, yeah, so the only way I can beat him at the end is with projectiles, because that's the only thing that hits him. How the more I, I hit him, the more damage he gets. That's kind of neat. It, it, until he doesn't have a hit, and then I can't punch him anymore. Then it kind of sucks. Oh crap, my. Escape a quarantine for the most deadly virus to ever happen like the dude was risking being patient zero. Yo! Yeah, two health. I had him. Can I skip this, please? button mashing. Yes! Finally! You can do it, thank you. Oh my god. My superpowers, it's useless! Goemon Impact, how fearsome! I know, after like eight tries. Uh, let's see. <laughs> it was a pleasure learning your fighting style. It was worth studying. All right, keep it up. Full steam ahead. Goemon's not even weirded out that they made a robot that, that's gigantic that looks just like him. Existing health problems? Oh, great. What a time for my mom to go to Taiwan. Meanwhile, then again, that's that's far enough away. We should be just fine. Ah, Shin, 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 Shin I couldn't even read his name. We'll have to turn it over to Marble Blue. Showdown with Kabuki Returns. The tale of the showdown with Kabuki Returns. Alright, hold on. I'm going to restart the stream because the sound's popping.
tudo. Ah, the game capture thing. All right, it's gonna, it's coming. All right, there it is. Okay, now I just need to see it on my screen. It's a four scrolling level with lamps. Ride, all right. Oh, uh, okay. A horn that shoots bubbles. Apparently it was man-made. The bubble horn. Oh, crap. Then again, that could just be a conspiracy theory thing that like someone said, unless like a real news organization. Oh my god, I can't believe I made that jump. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't even really watch news. I just, I didn't even know Kobe was gone until like, I was like, why is there, why are there all these videos on YouTube about Kobe? What's going on? It's like, oh, well, that's fucked up. Stupidly eating wild critters. Sometimes I like being completely oblivious. Sometimes it's to my benefit. Like devil loggers? You want a piece of me? Oh, he's got a hammer? Alright. Oh no, that gives me the projectiles. Crap. Oh, what's up, Jihee? How are you doing? Let's jump! Oh my god, I killed it! That statue came out of nowhere. I can't jump on top of it, though. Branching paths. Go to the mountains. Oh, we get this nice sunset. Odd. Who puts these floating platforms here? What is that? Oh, that was a bad. I thought it was a power up. I don't know why I thought it was a power up, but I didn't think it would be like a bad guy or like something something that hurts me. Yeah, there we go. Kind of works. That's even weirder. Oh my! Oh wow! Like Ink, is that the game where you try to infect as many people as possible? With an engineered man-made virus. Or am I thinking of another, like, Flash-based game? <laughs> Crap! Oh, I'm dead.
See, I know nothing about like the virus you guys are talking about. I don't I don't watch the news. I have no idea. I just know apparently it's a thing now. It's the new bird flu. It refused, fair enough. games where it's like you don't really have a strategy to you've seen it you know what I mean like it's kind of like so you're gonna die quite a lot just because you don't know what what's going on once you've seen it though it's it's kind of uh, it's not too big of a problem oh crap Oh, it starts. Oh, thank God. I'll see what that item is. Densely populated area. Oh, crap. Well, that's the thing about cities, right? Is like. That's, that's where, like, stuff like that's gonna happen, anyways, because. But then again, that's why, like, when the Europeans invaded the U.S., or, you know, when, when they colonized the U, um, the Americas, right, like, the primary, the big killer of, like, most native tribes was not really, like, the wars and stuff, it was disease. But that's because the native tribes didn't live in cities. Because the Europeans did, so they had more experience. Are these gonna keep moving? Alright. What am I- what am I even attacking? Are these, like, cats shoved into gnome hats? What- Yeah, flu is deadly to senior citizens. Oh, good, here we go. Thank you. I might as well do all the levels. Yeah, flu is primarily the most dangerous to like children and, and seniors though. Or if you have like, you know, very weak immune system. I'm liking this better than the third game. I mean, the third game had a lot of plot. Uh, the third game is more like an action RPG. This one's just more of a straight-up platformer. So I can only shoot up diagonally with... Oh, it doesn't matter now. I don't have the kunai. Or the projectile kunai. I have the other one. Now I got the kunai again. Okay, how did- oh. Okay. So you can shoot, like, diagonally up. It's weird. But only when you're jumping. But you can shoot diagonally down, too. That's not bad. Gone. I only got like one health. Corona beer? I mean, Corona beer is pretty terrible, so I, I mean, like, any reason not to drink it is probably a good idea. I like how in the States, Corona beer is like considered this great import beer, whereas in Mexico, it's like the cheapest beer. I feel like it's... <laughs> oh, 
Oh, thank goodness. Let's get some food. What's the point of getting food, though? Like, if I can just go at the end. Fast and delicious. Ah. Tofu soup. No, we're gonna get the cabbage pancake. Uh, it just it doesn't make max out my health. It just, just gives me more health. That, that sounds like something that Corona themselves have to do. Wait, wh why did that lady run away from me? I mean, I know I'm a weird-looking guy with, like, purple eyebrows. So, you know what? I'm gonna use the inn. Screw it. I don't need to use the inn, but I'm going to. I got all this money. I don't care. Alright, what's, what's, what's the best... What's the best room? I require the best quality. Oh, nice. There's some plants. <laughs> there, no, he's a robot ninja guy. It is nice that they added a save feature. I, I forget, was that in, like, Mystical Ninja? I don't think it was. Anything else? No. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Eh. Yeah, and you get it too, and so do you. Oh, a cop. Nothing going on here, sir. Another cop. Alright, yeah, you guys. Yeah, life sucks for you guys, huh? Oh wait, another cop. A pass. What's what's this hall pass for? Harmony General Store. It's the cheapest store in the Kensai area. Rice balls, pass. Iron armor. Yeah, let's get that. That sounds like Oh, it gives me three extra hits. Do I have enough for rice balls? I do not. Hold it right there. Nobody can cross without- Oh my god. Well, now I know why I need a pass. Now I have no money. Does that mean I can do like the levels again? Get back here! Is there like a gambling shop? Oh, what are these guys, samurais? Ha! I laugh at your samurai -ness. Um, hello. Hey there, boy. Want to play- Yes! It is ga- oh, it's just gambling. Okay, but then again, 10 and under is low, 11 and up is high. Well, are you gonna play or not? It's a gambling den, but she looks like she belongs in another type of den. Up for a game? Yes. I will bet it all. Hi. Damn straight. Low. It's like a 50-50. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, my God. And there goes all my money. No. You ruined me, like every gambling place. Travel agency. Don't need to go there. Alright, maybe I, I guess I go revisit the levels that I've already been to. That's what I get for splurging on the food and all the other stuff. Okay, this one was easy. Thank you. 
How much was that thing? It was like 400. I forgot how much I get from the raccoon at the end, or the tanuki. Oh my god. You know, crap like this really slows the game down, like having to earn a certain amount of money to get to the next part. I guess that's why they gave me two levels. These coins are loaves of bread, though. Two hundred eighty. Now I still need, still need more. So I guess beat the level again. Because it was like four eighty or something like that to get the pass. See, I don't, I don't, like, I'm not fighting bunnies, I'm fighting guys with bunny outfits, like, they're the bunny cult. Coins. I, I don't even need to kill them. Screw it. They just keep coming anyways. Hey, welcome back, Ginger Vitus. Yeah, the graphics are pretty nice on this. Got a lot of character. It's it's very, like, middle uh, Super Nintendo-like tech. When I kill with the range tech, you think that's what's going on? That might be it. Gotta get up close and stab him. But really, the big money, the big payout is at the end of the level. Because each kill is like about like five. But I think at the end of the level I get like 200 gold. Oh, we're like 10 away. All right, I can gamble. I, I can totally gamble. Let me, let me see exact if it is like how much it is. Okay, it is 480. All right, so all I need is 10. So I'll just go gamble for 10. It's all ghosts, really? Was it the ghost of Kobe Bryant? Oh, it's high. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play. Ten. I just need ten, so let's go high. 
Alright. Okay, I got the money. Now to leave. You won big, huh? Yeah, super big. Was I supposed to tip her? Like, why did it- why did it do that? Like, am I supposed to give her a tip or something? A little bit- yeah, that's what I was thinking of doing. Just as long as I- eventually I'd win and have enough. Too soon, isn't it? I see you've got a pass there with you. Go ahead and cross the bridge then. Alright, good. Well, now there's more stories, but I have no money. What is this? A bathhouse? Hot Springs. It's Konami Town's number one tourist destination. Wait, this is Konami Town? Well, crap, I can't go to the hot springs. I'll have to come back. Just rob some old ladies. You can see an island to the south of the city. That's where Mechanical World is. Nobody knows how you're supposed to get there. As, really, yeah, I mean, Mechanical World sounds pretty neat. Hey, it's the Konami guy. The Konami hotline can always help you out. Give us a call whenever you get stumped, okay? No! It's it's a 1-900 number. It's gonna cost me $1.70 the first minute. And then a dollar for every additional minute. If you ever get tired, it heals you right up after a tough journey. It's even better if you're already at full health. Really? Hmm. Look at that Konami promotion. In their own game. Hey, buddy. Did you hear? Right, right. Before that, you talked to the, um... What's it called? Talk to that one guy about Mechanical Town. Then you talked, and he's like, I don't know what to do. And then you go talk to Konami Hotline guy, and like... It's like setting you up, so you call Konami Hotline. Like, how do I get to that? Oh, wait. Press pause in a stage or town you cleared. And then press select to jump to the area map. No clue how that's done. It sounds tough. Well, I mean, you gotta have that thing. Cuddle pigs? I mean, someone needs to do it. Ever, you ever see that picture on the internet of that cuttlefish that looks like an octopus? Pigs need loving, too. Yeah, what's this guy doing? I heard there's a hidden path to Mechanical World. They say it's in the last place you'd expect. And it's also really hard to get there. Yeah, that's that's why they want me to call the Konami hotline. They're like, hey, call it so you know how to get to Mechanical World. Can't go there. Wait. Oh. That doesn't really help me in any way. It's... Last place I expect. Oh, like over these trees? No. Maybe if I, I rob this samurai. Oh no, now the cops are after me. Na 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 Batman! 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 Do 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 Batman! Oh, they generate from their servers? Cuttlefish with the Japanese guys eat when Kyle is part of a human Oh god. This, this thing has. Alright, Kabuki guys. Super Punch Out? You want Super Punch Out? Well, I still have to do, um. Well, I am on the Super Nintendo, so. But eventually I gotta do Majora's Mask while Jaffa Man's here, so someone can tell me how the hell to, to do anything in that game. I'm holding the button down, is it? Oop. Ah. Oh, you gotta, you gotta... Gotta charge it a little bit. Gotta get a couple of hops in. Did 
This is this drum is a musical instrument. Like, why am I bouncing around on it? It's a Kabuki thing. Again, these are Kabuki enemies. So, you guys, ever watch Kabuki theater? I've never done it. Played the arcade Punch Out and hated it. Yeah, I hear it's not that good. Whoa. You watch an episode? Oh yeah, that's close enough. That's like real Kabuki. I watched the um, the Star Wars Kabuki. You know of, of uh, what's it called? The, the Last Jedi. I was just watching a Slipknot show. <laughs> All right, never conquer. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Good luck with everything going on. Oh, you gotta tap. There's a kabuki band in the background full of rabbits. Ah, yes, of course. Hey, wait, somehow I have an extra health bar. When did that happen? I used to only have three health bars. Can I attack the hair? No. How am I supposed to get by that? Shampoo commercial. The Kabuki hair. I in Kabuki theater, like is it like old school medieval theater, like in in Europe where it's like there are no female actors, so that means that guys have to play women. I think that's the case, right? In Kabuki. Uh, I know two players can join in. I don't know, like, is modern Kabuki theater like that? Like, do they allow women actors? Or is, or are they keeping it traditional and it's just guys? I could be totally wrong on this. I, I might just be mixing it up with, like, old European theater. Oh, you can't jump over him, son of a bitch. Oh, crap. Is male dominated? You're not sure about modern Kabuki? Okay. They might have changed that rule. It might be different for each theater group, though. Some might be more traditional than others. Is that a guy? What the fuck? You think women are still banned? Oh. Do these lamps randomly catch on fire, just like real kabuki lamps? Why are they so dangerous? Maybe it wasn't a good idea to have paper wrapped around a flame, just saying. You know what this guy looks like? He looks like the shrimp from the Muppets. Well, he's dead now. I, I hope to God there's no such- well, there probably is such a thing as- how, how am I supposed to get by this? Every time the guy orgasms or something, like, you- the, the, you hear that word, yo. <laughs> <laughs> you hear that? Yo! <laughs> Did you just hear the drumming? <laughs> While it's going... Yo! <laughs> oh wait, shit, he's a kabuki fucking... <laughs>
How I've longed for revenge. Last time you beat me on Mount Tengu. I'm new in this video game. My character wasn't in the last one, but now I have a new mechanical body. It's all thanks to Master Marble Blue. Now you're about to experience. Yeah, it's like, it's like while while it's going on, you hear that like classic Kabuki thing, like that. And now that drum just gets faster. And then it's over. He does that like that palm thing and, and does the the face. <laughs> oh shit! I better fight this guy. Hey, get down here! I can't hit you when you're up there. There we go. Yeah, that neck thing, you do that a lot. It's an important part. You know, their makeup um, in Kabuki Theater... What's it called? Um, says a lot about their personality. Like, if they have, like... Um, like, their eyebrows are red and kind of, like, lightning bolts, that means that they're an angry person. So I could always get to the top three, but never win a game. Now playing squads, I can win games. Huh. I didn't even know Fortnite had a team thing going. I guess that makes sense. It's battle, you know. Hold on. Because you're playing for it. Did I save the... Okay, I think I did. Reset. <laughs> 